so hey y'all good morning how you guys doing i'm doing good so, hey. <laughs> y'all i'm silly but anyway let's talk about how you guys doing like what y'all been up to comment down below and let me know how y'all been doing So y'all know I did a live the other day. And when I did the live, I was in the gym. It was my first day. That was my first day back into the gym, right? By the way, I'm just leaving work. But anyway, so that was my first day back in the gym. Tell me, like today I'm not gonna go to the gym because my body kind of sore. So um, I'm gonna start back tomorrow. But tell me why is it when you trying to eat healthy and you trying to get back on the right track and you trying to get back in the gym and I don't know why I look white and say it today. And honey, another thing, when I was in the gym, they lighting it so ugly. It had me looking fat, ugly. It just had me looking crazy. It had my face looking, um, one part of my face looked it light, the other part looked it brown, like, I ain't know what was going on, but yeah. But anyway, so back to what I was saying. Y'all, why is it that when we start to try to, well, I'm not going to say we, it, it, I'm going to say just me because I don't know how it is with other people. But when I try to eat healthy and when I try to get back on the right track of exercising and, you know, just living a better life healthy-wise, choosing better stuff to eat, you know, choosing to go walking three miles, choosing to go to the gym and do other type of exercising. Why is it that that's when I crave sweets the most? Like literally, it is 8.41 in the morning. It is 65 degrees outside. It's a beautiful day. Wish that the temperature probably ain't got nothing to do with it, but it's whatever. But anywho, so, um, but the morning do. Why am I craving for finger butters, Krispy Kreme donuts? Like, I'm just craving for fat-ish. Like, fat girl-ish. And I'm like, what is going on? But, I don't know. Like, when I'm, when I'm not exercising or when I'm not trying to get back, like, to the right track, I don't crave for those things. I don't, I honestly, I don't crave for the things. I honestly just eat them because I want to eat them. Or I just eat them because somebody else is eating them by me or my children eating it. And I'm like, ooh, let me taste one. Ooh, let me get some. And if we go into a store run, if we're going for a store run for snacks and it's movie night or what have you or whatever, I'm going to pick up me some snacks too because I don't want to be the outcast because if I don't pick me up no snacks, and then I see them eating snacks. And then I'm be like, give me some of your snacks. And they're going to be like, mom, don't be eating up all my snacks or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, girl, get it together. Like, girl. So I'm going to try the little uh, 21 day thingy, you know, in the gym. You know, like they say, if you do something like, for, I think, 14 to 21 days, um, it becomes a habit so i'm gonna try to do that even though i'm not doing today because i have some important errands to run this morning so um i'm not gonna be able to hit the gym today but i'm trying to make it my best that before i leave work i go to the work gym because i think that will be better for me instead of just leaving leaving the um the workplace because if i leave out the workplace and i call myself going to the gym, I'm going to end up stopping at McDonald's, getting an iced coffee, getting me McDonald's breakfast, or doing something crazy, getting something crazy to eat. Then, on my way to the gym, I'm going to be like, I'm tired. I'm sleepy. So, I just want to try to at least, you know, just kill all the extra stuff that come with trying to, um, work out so the best thing for me to do is just to continue to stay on campus where I work at and just go to the gym so it won't be no excuses you 
see what I'm saying? Because, honey, I will have excuse after excuse, honey. I'll be like, uh uh. I know, I just got work. I stayed up all night. Da 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 this, da 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 that. And, you know, what have you. And excuses of excuses will keep coming up. I'll keep bringing up some excuses. And I'll be like, I just ate, I'm tired. Or I worked all night, I'm tired. Or this and that and that. So I just found a better way to not bring up excuses or you know what I'm saying maybe I'm not wording it right or what have you but um, I just feel like it'll be better for me just to go ahead and go to the gym while I'm on the work property while I'm still on the campus and I can just go ahead and knock that out so when I do leave I'll be ready to go home and I'll be I'll be tired. I can just hurry up and hop in the shower and then hop in the bed. And do it all over again. You feel me? And I feel like the days that I um work, that's a good enough days to work out. Like, come on. Four days is good. Or either I can miss a day. It could be three days, but see, I don't really need to be talking like that right now. I'm talking about missing a day. But, um, yeah. Yeah, y'all, so. And then I be wanting me a, um iced coffee. I love me some iced coffees, but I need to um, find a more healthier alternative, you know what I'm saying, to pick in the store. Like, I know I did. I was doing the um, dairy-free creamers, but I need to do the um, sugar-free creamers as well. As well. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. But then I also don't want to put too much, too much on myself. Like be too hard on myself on this healthy eating journey because I'm telling you, I believe that I can eat what I want, but with moderation, if that makes sense. So um, I'm gonna try that with moderation like if I want a candy bar eat a quarter of a candy bar if that makes sense because it's four quarters in a dollar but if I eat a quarter of it or if I buy many of a mini size of it that should be fine right just don't eat the whole candy bar just don't eat more than one candy bar okay if I want an ice cream cone eat half of the ice cream cone Shaquetta. If I want a donut, eat two percent of the donut. <laughs> or I can find something else healthier that's giving that taste. You feel what I'm saying? It's, it's it's other healthier alternatives out there. You know, I don't have to just always, you know, just get that particular craving that I'm craving for that particular food and just continue just to be fat no 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 we're going to substitute we're going to substitute we're going to get like because I know they got like some keto um chocolate out and I've been hearing a lot of people rave about it they be like oh this tastes just like a Reese. oh this tastes just like the MLM so I'm gonna go to Sam one of these days and I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna try it out and I think they got it in Walmart if I'm not mistaken but I do but I do need to make a trip to Sam's because I haven't been in a while. But I don't know which day when I'm gonna make it up there. But I'm gonna make it up there. And they also have like the sugar-free um because I'm I'm a um chocolate girl, not like a chocolate chocolate girl like chocolate cake and stuff like that. I don't like chocolate cake. I the only way I eat chocolate cake is like if I'm is if I'm in that moment and I'm craving for it. But I. I usually don't crave chocolate cake. Like, I'm a cheesecake person, a strawberry shortcake person, strawberry cake, ups, pineapple, upside down cake, you know, stuff like that, muffins and candy bars and stuff like that, ice creams. I'm a haagen girl, you know, um, Haagen-Dazs, haagen I hope I'm saying it right. But anyway, so yeah, so um, I just got to figure it out. I gotta figure it out, y'all. I gotta figure out, you know, what what to do and how to eat, you know? And it, it shouldn't be hard. You know, I believe if I put my mind to it, I can do it, you know? If I put 
put my mind to it and be serious this time, I can do it because your girl was looking extra big. She was looking off on that um tread me. I'm like, who is this? When I re looked at it, I was like, am I a dude? And I'm turning into a dude? Like, what is going on? Ew. Like, all up in here, just big. Face big, neck big, shoulders big. Look like I had an Adam's apple. I don't know what that was poking out, but it, it was the lighting. You know what I'm saying? It was giving very much big and ugly. <laughs> but nah, y'all, for real, I got, to, I got to do this. I got to do this. I got to do this. So right now, I'm just finna go um, handle some business. I'm going to be back on here in a little bit. I guess I'm going to start back vlogging. Because, baby, them shorts. I think them shorts is what's bringing my watch time down. It's doing something. Like, doing all them shorts, uh-uh. That ain't, that, that ain't going to work. That ain't going to work for water. Mm -mm. It's something going on with the atherism or whatever it's called. The, the watch hours. Whatever it is, because I've been looking at, I've been trying to educate myself on this YouTube channel, how I'm going to go about it, and you know what I'm saying, what need to be done and what don't need to be done, what I need to do and what I don't need to do. Like, I am watching videos so I can educate myself and I can bring the content, baby. I can bring the content. I'm even watching videos on how to set my cameras, even though I have the manual um, book but I'm more of a visual person I like to read it and see what see exactly how to do it so yeah so uh, we gonna finish getting educated and we gonna bring that content you feel me but I'm gonna get back on here in a little bit so y'all I finally made it back and these are the chips that I was talking about in the car um, I don't know if these new or not, but I seen them and I wanted to try them. They pop chips. They got the sea salt and barbecue and the sovereign cream. And there go the chips I was talking about for my kids. I think, what kind of these? They were $18, the bowl mix. And so we love hagen dyes in here, so I got those. How many in here? But anyway. They cheaper at Sam's. You get more. 15 bars. I think it was like $12. We ain't never had no Oreo bars. But really, I probably get one or two out of here like every once in a blue moon since I'm trying to eat healthy. And these I basically brought for my kids. They can have whatever. These carrots I brought to make um, a juice. I do have a juicer. I want to try juicing more often. I think I'm going to do a mixture of carrots and pineapple i haven't decided yet i got some strawberries i got some spinach i like to have a spinach salad or either put the spinach in my eggs and these are the broccoli florets i was talking about um i got some lime i got these little potatoes they was on sale actually for six dollars and something and then i got this almond and pecan crunch and I got these chicken fajita strips. I like to throw salads on. I like to throw those on salads. Then I got some honey barbecue boneless chicken bites. Then I got my trigger also some spicy chicken breast fillets. And then I got some um, some Tyson's um, thin slice boneless chicken breast. I cannot stand thick breasts. It, it just do something to me. And just do something to me. And those are some muffins that we brought yesterday. Because we went to Sam's yesterday. But I already put that other stuff up. So I know y'all might not want to see that. It really wasn't that much. We just went through. And we had got some cleaner stuff or whatever. I had got, which I already, there's some water and some water more in the trunk. But I had picked up these because I used these. And I seen that it was a better deal. It was $18, but they gave me an extra one stick and, you know, the refills. So, yeah. So oh, yeah, y'all. This is what I got from Sam. And I'm going to be back. I'm going to put all the food up, honey.
what you think, mom? And I wanted my skin to stay on because I like the crispiness. I want the skin to be a little crispy. A little crispy. And so now we're going to put our onions and bell peppers. Can I get some olive oil? And mom going to drizzle some olive oil on top. It's in there. Mom, that look good, y'all. I'm pressing, I'm telling Simone to press the stop button. Today is Tuesday, baby, and it is 68 degrees out here, and this is my type of weather, and yeah, I'm not too long ago getting off of work. Y'all can see I'm still in my uniform or whatever, what have you, but we finna go to Starbucks, and we finna go to Target since I'm in this area, y'all, and I might have to hurry up and wrap this little part of my video up because y'all on the dashboard and the sun is out and I don't want my phone to run hot because it can run hot real real quick because the sun be beaming on it or whatever but I'm gonna um, put the little AC on a little bit but it's kind of cool outside I like the weather it's giving fall it's giving very 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 much fall but anyway y'all I want to talk to y'all about this upload I did the other day on my channel like people is really really mean like these people is crazy on the internet you feel me but I can take criticism i can take being in the kitchen when it's hot as hell because it don't bother me you feel what i'm saying by the grace of god it don't bother me he gave me tough skin but any food so i uploaded like a hack of getting like soap scum or you know just like black build up dirt off of my own shower i really do believe that some of it was there before i even moved in but I think we added on to it because me and my daughter, we share bathrooms and my sons, I got three sons that stay with me. They share the hallway bathroom. And my oldest daughter, she still lives in Atlanta, the Atlanta area, right? So anywho, I had did, I recently did a clean with me on my channel. And so I couldn't get my arm um, tub clean. I didn't know what else to do to get it clean like I, I just didn't know what to do so I'll use some of everything the comic the Ajax the um, pink stuff um, the toilet bowl cleanser like I used a lot of stuff so it never get it out it never did get it out so even though it's plastic or what have you whatever it just wasn't coming off it, it just wasn't doing what it was supposed to do so my daughter she was cleaning up the um, shower that day that I um, did a uh, short and the short said something like um, a hack hack of cleaning your shower something like it was I know it had a hack in it or whatever so she decided to boil some water in the kettle and so when she boiled the water she came in the bathroom she said mom let's see if this worked and so she saturated the tub with bleach so being though that she saturated the tub with bleach it was a, uh, uh, where is Starbucks? Excuse me, I'm looking for Starbucks. But it was a, um, a flosser in a tub. So, 
my daughter, she had the faucet in her mouth. But as she was putting the bleach in the tub, the flosser, the flosser fell out of her mouth into the tub. So we just left it there because it was bleach on it. But we knew that we was going to pick it up. We knew we were going to get it up. And so when I said, well, let me put this on, you know, YouTube as a short. Maybe somebody can comment and let me know what they use or what they have. You know what I'm saying? To get this soap scum or get this dark black stuff up or whatever would have you up off of the shower. The shower floor or whatever. Y'all, I had so many critics. I had so many judgmental people on my damn short they was rude they were saying crazy stuff i mean they was mean i mean i my motto is if you don't have nothing nice to say don't say it at all like if you didn't like my video you didn't like what i did my little short how i cleaned it or how we you know what I'm saying came up with the hat it might not be a hat for you but it was a hat for me and mine because we didn't know we didn't know that we can use um boiling hot water and bleach to get up the um um embedded soap scum that was inside of the shower honey <clears throat> people are mean it was just rude they were so much focused majority of the people and it was some kind people that left some comments under my arm short about the hat <laughs> some people like bleach they were like bleach is so harsh or some people was like you're gonna melt your pipes with the um the boiling hot water and that in case why the hell the um the um the flosser didn't melt it was plastic but anyhow anywho and i i, I i'm open to suggestions and open to suggestions and stuff like that but some people that was coming on there it was like what the fuck and one girl, she was like, this is clip bait. And she was trying to make it seem like it, as if I was slow or something was wrong with me. And I did a little comments. I comment back, you know, I, I, did, I, I did a little responding back to their comments or whatever, what have you. But it wasn't nothing harsh or disrespectful because I'm not finna get out of character. I'm not finna let YouTube or no type of social media or people that's in my presence get me out of character for what? No ma'am. No ma'am, no sir. It ain't it ain't worth it. But anywho, they 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 were just going in for me. They they not for me, but they were just going in at me. They was going in at me. And me and my kids, we was just strolling through the um through the comments. We were strolling through the comments laughing. <clears throat> Cause it was funny to us. It was real funny. And then they were talking about the dude in the background. Cause my, my son, he was like scrubby dub dub. They were talking about some of your man in the background. He's saying that, this and that and that. Excuse me, that's my son. <clears throat> like people is crazy. But this is the type of um, work I want to do. I want to be a creative content, a creative content. And I like YouTube. So this is what comes with social media and stuff like that. But I'm glad that God blessed me with thick skin because honey, <clears throat> I see you then it's like I don't see you I hear you then it's like I don't hear you especially when it's negative comments and it's negativity I hate negative you know what I'm saying like I said my model is if you don't have nothing good to say don't say it at all like come on if you don't like my channel why do you put so much infants in and so much, uh, much, much of your energy and strength in to hit the down button the down um the hit thumbs down or to comment something negative or or you know i'm okay you entitled to your own opinion that's cool that's fine i'm i'm willing to you know listen to what you got to say read it sometimes i don't read it because sometimes it just be negative stuff um and that's about it like I'm not mad. I'm not holding no grudges. Like, you just, everyone is entitled to their own opinion. If they feel like um, what I did was weird and crazy. And, the, well, basically, the most focus, the most focus was on the, um, the, um, why well, I can't talk, y'all. The most focus they had was on the, um, on the, um,
Here goes Starbucks. The most focus was on the um the flosser. They were so focused on the flosser being floating around in the tub. But it was just weird that somebody said something about my daughter's feet. They were like, um, I can smell it or something. They were just rude, honey. They was they were just it was crazy. But thank you for the view. Thank you for the comments, whether they good or bad. Like you help me. Like like I said, if I come across when I come across stuff on um YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, any type of social media outlet, if I don't agree with something, I'm not getting on them people page talking crazy or stating my opinion or my suggestions and I just feel like no, I just don't want to do that. Okay. It's not worth it. That's that's giving out too much too much energy. You know what I'm saying? Too much. Too much. Too much, girl. Too much. Too much. Then one girl, she gonna come on my on my um comments. Tell my son, what the fuck? I mean, I'm like, honey, I just blocked her, baby. I ain't never seen you a day in my life. Why I look white on you, y'all? Baby, I ain't never seen you in the day of my life. I don't even know you. And then the fact, and and no, and no um offense to no other nationality, no other race or whatever. And then somebody told me that I'm I sound much racist, racist. So y'all, my phone cut off while I was ordering my drink. So I got the ice white chocolate mocha. I got the grande size. I don't want to be too, too hype because I got to go home and go to sleep and get ready, be ready for work tonight. But anyway, anywho, I had to do a couple of errands today. So that's why I'm out. I had to run, the, um, run a couple of errands. And so I'm um, by Target. I'm just going to go in there and see what I can get out of there. See if I see anything of interest. I haven't been in a while. That's why I say the next place I move, I got to move where Target is. Cause I don't, I don't, I don't want to ride a whole 45 minutes or a whole hour just to go to Target. Uh uh, we're not gonna do that, girl. That don't make any sense. Well, it really do make sense because you know I like Target, but. Mm -mm. But yeah, I'm hungry, so yeah, that what it was. That what it was. They was trying me. They was trying me. They was trying me. They was trying me on my own YouTube. They was like, mm, 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 girl. But I'm, 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 I'm gonna say this. I do appreciate the people that get that gave out good hacks and um good advice things to use and what to do i appreciate y'all and i thank y'all for the positive and the um good comments so yeah but all that negative stuff you got to get up off my page because we ain't gonna be doing that you will get blocked you will get blocked dismissed and forgot i don't even not know you to to really just to remember you you know what i'm saying but don't come over here to my page thinking that you're going to be slick with the mouth and don't get blocked because you're going to get blocked one two three block <laughs> i don't know you i don't know you in real life this is my content this is what i'm putting out if you don't like it go to the next go to the next page just like the lady said when i told y'all that the lady told me so i'm boring that was her that was her opinion she's entitled to her opinion and i'm happy that she went elsewhere and i hope she found what she needed on um, period Good morning. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You do the same. Thanks. Well, yeah, y'all. Yeah, so. We're going to get this champagne in here. And head on back to Target. But I probably, um, I 
I think I'm going the wrong way, y'all. I'm like, I'm going through the drive-thru again. But um, what I'm going to say.